Hello students and welcome to the next lesson in our AS Human Geography course. Today we're going to be looking at energy conservation. Energy conservation. Energy conservation are the methods used to reduce the total amount of energy that are going to be consumed and used. This is mainly done by using less of a certain energy resource, improving the energy resource's efficiency so we don't have to use as much in order to get the same gain from it, and using alternative energy resources. The 2007 White Paper on Energy The government always tries to reduce the amount of energy we're going to be consuming. The UK introduced the 2007 White Paper on Energy, which aimed to execute many conservation initiatives. For example, some of these initiatives included using smart electricity meters. These would then show you how much you're consuming, so if you know you're consuming too much, you can stop the amounts of consumption by simply switching a lot of devices off. They also work with industry in order to phase out goods which are using too much energy, such as the old television sets. They may work with shops to buy out all of the old television sets which aren't being sold or which could potentially get sold because those consume a lot more energy. They also use more renewable energy resources. In 2020, it's aimed that 20% of all UK electricity should be produced from renewable energy resources, such as that of wind farms and hydroelectric power. Setting up pollution permit schemes are also part of the 2007 White Paper on Energy. This happens where firms will need a permit in order to emit waste gas and it's going to limit the amount of gas they're going to be able to pollute into the atmosphere. It's also going to provide £35 million into green transport research and development. So as a result, we can start to use more hybrid cars and integrated transport. So as a result, we don't have to consume as much energy on less effective ways such as using the tube or perhaps um, as using the buses. Here are some questions on energy conservation. Have a go at answering these on another sheet of paper by pausing the video and hit play whenever you're ready to see the answers. Here are the answers. If you got all of these right, congratulations. I'd advise you to move on to the next video, which will be on appropriate technology. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.